Mm. What the? Where am I? Is this another dream? Don't be stupid, Emma. Of course it bloody is. What is this place? Looks like another empty room. Well, I guess any minute either Jack or Mark are probably going to show up. I hate to admit it, but I've gotten used to these nightmares. Fucking stupid things. I wouldn't exactly hold your breath. Excuse me? Whoa, 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 whoa! Y you're me! Hmm. <laughs> I love to disagree, but I wouldn't be caught dead being you. Your fashion sense is horrible, and frankly, I'm just more beautiful than you. What? Okay. What do you mean by, I shouldn't hold my breath? That's usually what happens. Mark and Jack turn up. Hmm, true. But they wouldn't come to you if I didn't say so. What? Hang on. You're telling me that you're the one in charge? But you are me. Hmm, maybe in the beginning I was. But I've outgrown you. You see, I now no longer need you. And soon enough, You'll be gone. Just like the rest of them. The rest of who? This is crazy. It's just a weird nightmare. Is it now? Tell me, what happened the last time you had a nightmare? <laughs> scratch. No, it can't be real. <laughs> Some nightmares are more real than you'd think. Auntie and Dark certainly had their fun with you. Which reminds me, you haven't met my newest friend. Oh, Danny! I could kill <laughs> you. I could kill you right now. I could just totally stab you. D dan Now, now, Danny. We mustn't ruin her body. I know you want to play, but we can't just yet. Why don't you run along and find Phil? I'm sure he's dying to play with you. Okay. Why does he listen to what you say? Why the hell are you in charge? Oh, I'm not really. But my boys do pay attention to my suggestions, after all. Auntie may have created me, but he does have a keen ear when it comes to my... suggestions. So why not kill me? You've had plenty of opportunities. Why? Because I still need your body, dearie. Oh, come now. If you haven't worked out what I want by now, then you're about as intelligent as dish soap. You want my body so you can live in the real world? Ding, ding, ding! Oh my lord, she's not as stupid as she looks. No, I won't let you take over. This is my body. I'm not just going to give it up. Ooh, so scary. But you haven't got your friends this time to help you. My plan is already in action, and it's too late to stop it. Oh, boy! Get <laughs> her down, Uchi. <laughs> no! Let me go, you psycho! Ah, oh, psycho is such a mean word. I suppose you should just call me... Shadow Shion, perhaps? Is that not what you call yourself on that awful YouTube channel of yours? <sighs> now. Let me take over. <coughs> no. <coughs> Shame you won't come quietly. Such a pain. Leave her be, boys. She has nowhere to run to after all. I will find you. to talk to me? Yeah, you remember those nightmares I told you about? 
Mmm, the ones with Jack and Mark? Right. I had another. But it wasn't just them this time. I saw... me. Or a dark version of me at the very least. Somehow I woke up covered in bruises. Any idea how you got them? Not a clue. I can only think that I probably got them in the dream. Um, you can't get hurt in a dream. I know I can't. That's what's so bizarre. I know there's no way I could have been hurt, but that's the only explanation. So, have you spoken to them? Jack and Mark, I mean. I tried. They wouldn't answer any of my calls. I texted Sign and Amy. Apparently they went out together for something, but that was two days ago, and they still aren't back. I'm getting a very bad feeling about this. The Shadow Me said she had a plan. What if she got them? Chloe, what if she got Auntie and Dark to capture them? Okay, okay. Sounding a little crazy right now. Just calm down and we'll find them, okay? Come on, we'll go see Sign. I'll get the car. <laughs>